Today, I pray that you are able to break the bonds of negativity and clear the way in you for harmony. You know, it's physically impossible to hug someone if a brick wall separates you from that person. If any brick walls of negative thoughts that you build in your mind, well, if they separate you from another person, it's impossible for you to have harmony with that person. They can be barriers that come between you and others. So do not let negative thoughts or experiences build barriers around you. You find that when you do, you're the one in prison, not them. As you let love and understanding of your spiritual nature come forth in your thoughts and in your conversations, you will establish harmony in your relationships. The Spirit of God is the core of your being. And as you let Spirit move you, you will forgive and you'll go on with your life. Forgiveness, it promotes healing in all of your relationships with all others. As you forgive, you open the way for relationships that are harmonious and meaningful. There was once a woman that forgave her sister and she had a better relationship with her sister, had more harmony after that, but her sister really could never release it. However, there was a dramatic change in that woman's life. People that she was at odds with in the past, they started to come to her in a new way, relate to her in a new way. She found that she had more friends. See, the barriers that you construct for protection, so-called protection, against one person, it also fences you in from others. And when you tear down that barrier in you, it brings untold blessing into your life. Sometimes not necessarily from the person that you're forgiving. You know, the forgiveness that you do, it is it is releasing the poison that's in you. It has nothing to do with them. So I pray that you knock down barriers that are in you, that you have more harmony in your life with all others, that you have a Christ attitude in and through you of love and acceptance. You know, in Psalms 119, verse 165, it says, Great peace have those who love your law. Well, the law, the ultimate law of God, is love. And when we love and when we create and build harmony, we stop building walls we build something that people can come across easy to touch us, and we can go across easy to touch them.